Understanding Capital Deficit, a guide for English learners. Hello everyone, and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a financial term that can be a bit tricky, capital deficit. This phrase is not just important for understanding finance-related topics, but it also gives you a glimpse into how English phrases can be constructed in a business context. Capital deficit refers to a situation where a company's liabilities exceed its assets. In simpler terms, it means that the company owes more than it owns or is worth. This is a critical concept in business and economics, as it often indicates financial trouble for a company. Understanding this term will help you grasp more complex financial discussions. The phrase consists of two words, capital and deficit. Capital in a business context usually refers to the financial assets or resources that a company uses to fund its operations and grow. Deficit, on the other hand, indicates a shortage or lack. When combined, these words describe a shortfall in the necessary resources or assets a company should have. To better understand capital deficit, let's see how it's used in sentences. The company's capital deficit has raised concerns among its investors. Due to the capital deficit, the firm is considering various fundraising options. These examples show how the term is typically used in financial news or discussions. As an English learner, understanding phrases like capital deficit is crucial, especially if you're interested in business, finance, or economics. It not only enriches your vocabulary but also enhances your comprehension of financial news and reports. I hope this video has shed light on the meaning and usage of capital deficit. Understanding such terms is a big step forward in mastering English, especially in professional contexts. Keep learning and see you in our next session.